Welcome to this week's edition of the Fordham Ram Roundup with Fordham baseball coach Kevin Layton. Kevin, after a little bit of a rough stretch there over that two-week span, win four straight last week to kind of get yourself going again uh, in non-conference play heading into those last two conference weekends. What did you take from last week to build upon going into this weekend against UMass? Yeah, you know, I think we were just in a tough uh, tough run of things there. You know, things didn't seem to happen for us. Um, but it was good to see us uh, bounce back against Hofstra in, in a tough game. We had a, a huge hit from uh, Jake Baker and um, and then take that into the weekend against LIU. And, and in those games, um, you know, there's a lot of uh, a lot of the games where we were behind and we were able to come back. So uh, that's something we have to do. I mean, we've got to keep fighting and, and scratching and clawing and, and finding ways to win. And, um, you know, I think if we uh, give 100%, uh, you know, things will start happening for us. And uh, I think this weekend was a good, uh, was good evidence of that. I know the last couple of weeks, uh, two, two pitchers that have really come up big, Kyle Martin out of the bullpen and also Shane McDonald pitching very well out of the bullpen last week, picks up two wins. What did you see out of them most recently la last week out of those two guys uh, coming out of the bullpen? Uh, strikes. I mean, both guys uh, just come in throwing strikes, attacking the zone. They both have good stuff. Um, and they've been uh, you know big parts of our success, being able to uh, keep – teams off the board in the later inning, innings, typically uh, six, seven, eight, uh, or seven, eight. Um, so we need those guys to really uh, keep performing and um, and uh, doing what they've been doing. It's, it's been uh, tremendous. I've been really happy with both those guys. One of your seniors hit a couple of milestones this week. Mark Donatio, 200th game played, also picks up his 200th hit in the last game against LAU Brooklyn. What has he meant to this program over the last four years? Yeah, he's a guy that, um, you know, just a tough kid, uh, plays the game hard, uh, finds a way. You know, I think early on in, in his career, um, you know, didn't come in right away as a starter. And, and I, I think for, for him, he's made himself a starter and, uh, he's run with it. Uh, he's never um, had those lapses or, or struggles. Um, he's always been a pretty consistent hitter um, and, and just doing the job. And it just great to see him, uh, you know, to only be 15 guys to wear this uniform to get 200-plus uh, hits is, is a special moment and um, really happy for him. This weekend, you guys are hosting UMass, you know, final conference home weekend. I uh, still have the one more against St. Bonaventure. I know it's game to game, but what's the one key as you get into each game that you guys got to come on the plus side to have a chance to win this week? Uh, we have to execute. You know, I mean, we, we have opportunities to move runners up. We got to do it. And, uh, and we have when we have opportunities to score runs, we have to do it. Um, you know, I, I think our pitching has been solid all year. It's going to keep us in games for the most part. And um, we just have to capitalize when we when we have the opportunities. Um, a you know, big goal is going to be to score first. Uh, I think when we can score first and, and get ourselves feeling good, uh, more runs will come. Uh, so it's just we have to uh, be ready and, and treat each inning like it's the ninth inning and, and uh, capitalize on any mistakes at uh, UMass and, and hopefully um, Bonaventure when we get up there and make. So uh, it's a tough uh, six, but we're, we're ready. All right, well, thanks so much, Coach, and best of luck this weekend. Thanks, Scott. Be right back with our player interview with Mark Donadio. Here with our player interview with senior outfielder Mark Donatio. Mark, you guys come in on a four-game win streak heading into a huge weekend against UMass. What are the team's feelings heading into this weekend set against the Minutemen? Uh, we're feeling pretty good about ourselves. Uh, we won four games in a row right now. And I thought we fought, uh, fought hard all weekend, and uh, pitchers kept us in the game when we needed to. And we just came up with a big hit at the end to uh, give us the wins. I know they say you take every game one game at a time, but going into this weekend to make sure you guys stay in games this weekend, to stay tight with UMass, what is that one thing you guys need to do? Uh, we just need to come out and play our game, uh, pitch well, and uh, get time we hits when we need to, and uh, I think that will help us keep the uh, energy up in the dugout, and uh, we should be able to have good success this weekend. I know this past weekend you hit a couple of big career milestones for yourself, 200 games played, and you get your 200th career hit. What does that mean for you to reach both those milestones in a Fordham uniform? Uh, it's a pretty cool milestone. Um, I'd like to thank the support from my, uh, my teammates and my coaches for believing me throughout the four years. And uh, just looking forward to keep it going and uh, into playoffs and hopefully make it run at the end of the year. Now I got to ask, was there any type of brother competition with you and your brother as to who would hit that milestone first or anything like that? No, I mean, he uh, got off to a faster start in the year, so uh, he deserved it more than me. <laughs> All 
Well, Mark, best of luck this week, and congratulations on the milestone, and we'll see you this weekend against UMass. Appreciate it, Scotty. Thanks a lot. That will do it for this week's edition of the Fordham Ram Roundup. Special thanks to head coach Kevin Layton and senior outfielder Mark Donadio for joining us. The Rams take on the UMass Minutemen this weekend. Schedule has been updated. The Rams and Minutemen will play a 3 p.m. doubleheader on Friday, and the final game of the series will take place either on Saturday at 2 p.m. or Sunday at noon, depending upon the weather. Once again, the doubleheader on, Thursday, on Friday at 3 p.m., between UMass and Fordham, and then the final game on either Saturday or Sunday, depending upon the weather. Check out FordhamSports.com as well as at Fordham Baseball or at Fordham Rams Twitter account to get all the latest schedule updates. For the Fordham Ram Roundup, I'm Scott Kwiatkowski, and we'll see you next time.